has potential to provide better access of funding to local and national actors are we successful in that or not we'll hear from our panel member in your opinion uh, what are the advantages of the pooled fund to support localization process we were able to prove to the donors that if a national organization is given the responsibility of managing and disbursing funds to small local organizations then it is cost effective it is more grounded in reality in in very basic terms the risk pooled fund can be seen um in many ways as an insurance mechanism but um what we've been looking at um more recently is how to do this in a way that is less about insurance and more about um a solidarity we do think as ocha that this has been a, a relatively successful mechanism for bridging that gap and there is quite a lot of effort being put into doing more to make it more accessible and to reach to partners because we know we are running out of um not running out of money <laughs> but running out of the political will i think in some senses to start it work in our commitment to localization effort is now introducing a innovative concept that actually mentioned that we call is a hubs 82% say about the challenge that it is an uneven competition for local actors as even i and you also compete for the same kind of With the CBPF, we can really do more. In general, the call is how do we really make this pooled fund really accessible by the local actors and may really make it sustainable and long-term in providing solutions.